Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Lazy Sketch Thoughts. In case you kind of missed it, oh yeah, happy Friday. But in case you kind of missed it, baseball's in controversy again. <gasps> Shocker, who would have thought, right? Well, last night, if you saw the game, the Mets game, Michael Conforto, bases loaded. I think there might have been two outs, tie game. Uh, it was a ball over the plate, like it registered in the strike zone as a strike. Conforto leans in, puts six his elbow pad out, hits his elbow pad. The umpire goes to strike him out because he thinks it's a strike. Then from there, he goes, wait, wait, hit by pitch, take your base, you know, Mets win. Everybody's like, hmm, he leaned into that. Well, number one, the rule does state that you have to try and get out of the way. But even if you don't want to do that, because I always thought that was kind of a stupid rule, the rule states that if the ball travels through the strike zone and it hits you, it doesn't matter if it's a strike. It's the same thing as if you swing the bat and it still hits you, it's still a strike. It doesn't matter. So the umpire obviously thought it was a strike. He went to ring him up, and then you realize, no, that ball hit him instead of the catcher. Take your base. So right there, he should have been out. And then from, there's a ghost in my room, apparently. The lights are flickering. But, like, from there, you play another inning. But instead, they just, like, I guess, didn't know the rules. Like, the umpire, like, just doesn't know the rules. Man, this ghost flickering in my light right now, it's a, little, it's a little scary. But I don't understand, like, the umpire of the major leagues didn't understand this rule. They took it to New York. They did a review. The review said, you know, hit by pitch, whatever, yada, yada, yada. And that's it. The bats win. And then baseball Twitter had to, you know, fight over it for the next, you know what baseball Twitter does forever, all night, basically. You have Mets fans being like, yeah, you know, win at any cost. Marlins fans mad, all the other fans of every other team mad. But you know what's the funny part? Michael Conforto, he's a, let's be honest here, he's a great hitter. He's a great player, but he's been struggling this year. And I once had a baseball coach and he used to tell us, if you can't hit, get hit. <laughs> yep, he used to tell that to our, our little 12 year old selves. And I use a high school coach too. If you can't hit, get hit. Lean in, crowd the plate, get hit by an inside fastball, take a base. And that's kind of what he did there. He was like two strikes, two outs, bases loaded. I've been struggling this year. Man, let me lean, let me lean into one real quick. Let me let me let me win this game for my team real quick. And it's the one thing that kind of sucks about elbow guards. You've been seeing that a lot more lately. Because a lot more guys would be willing to lean in and let one bounce off the guard to where they can't feel it. And then stuff like that happens. I don't really care. But at the end of the day, the ball passed through the strike zone. It's a strike. He should have been ruled out. They should have went to keep playing extra innings. Regardless, the Mets won. It was ruled poorly, but luckily there's 162 games. So there's enough games for them to eventually, you know, get a missed call here or there. Plus, it's the Mets. They, they never really get luck. They never get anything go their way. But at the end of the day, the ball's a strike. Should have been called a strike. It doesn't matter that hit him. The rules in the Major League Baseball rule book literally states that if a ball travels through the strike zone or if a player is ruled that he swung, even if it hits him, it is still a strike. Therefore, strike three, three outs, move on. Like, that's what how it should have been ruled. It was ruled incorrectly. There's really no debate. There's really no argument. He leaned into it. It doesn't really matter if he leaned into it or not because the ball went over the strike zone. It's really nothing to discuss. Um, it's a stupid controversy. It's a lot of people arguing over dumb stuff. But at the end of the day, the, the, the way that the rule is written, regardless of how you feel about it, it should have been a strike. The Marlins got boned, but kind of thing happens in sports. I'm a Saints fan. It's really hard for me to feel bad about referees and umpires and stuff, you know, messing up other teams. So... Yeah, it's kind of hard for me to feel like too, too bad for him. But at the end of the day, Marlins, call up Sixto Sanchez, please. My fantasy team, you could really use it. Um, but Mets fans, just know like, bro, I'm, I don't really care. I'm not going to argue with you. Should have been a strike three. Should have been out. Ball passed through the strike zone. And that's the end of it. Anyways, guys, hopefully that kind of cleared up the rule for you. It, maybe if you didn't know it, there are people who may not just know that rule. Newer fans who may be, you know, newer to baseball, newer to sports in general, you know. So there you go. You learn something new every day. And if you didn't see the controversy on Twitter, go look up. Just go search like Conforto on Twitter. Like you'll see some interesting stuff. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys have a great weekend. Uh, if you like the video, please like, subscribe for more content like this. Check out the description of this episode. Uh, you can find all of our other social media accounts, all the other work that we do. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.